lay something down for you. I'll play a whole town for you. Spray the whole hundred round for you. Twisting all my fingers for my dog. You my treacherous little twin, and you know that we locked in. And I love you like my kin, it's whatever for you. I go up and down that road, I go anywhere you go. When you tell me life is good, I want better for you. Yeah. You my twin. You my twin. You my treacherous little twin. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute. Since we last kicked By the way, just got in town And I won't let you me in this cloud all in the sky 21, can you do something for me? 21. Can you hit a little rich flex for me? And then 21, can you do something for me? 21. Drop some bars to my pussy ex for me And then 21, 21, can you do something for me? Can you talk to the ops next for me? Okay. 21, do your thing, 21, do your thing. Do your thing, 21. Yellow diamonds in the watch. This shit costs a lot. Never send a bitch or die. That's how you get shot. I DM in banish mode, I do that shit a lot. Took her panties off and this bitch thicker than the plot. All my exes ain't nothing, them hoes busted. If my ops ain't rapping, they ass ducking. You ain't ready to pull the trigger. Don't clutch it. I know you on your care, baby. Can you suck it? I'm a savage. Smack her, booty, and magic. I slap a pussy nigga with the ratchets. I might slap a track on his whip and get the address. Don't call me on Christmas Eve, bitch. Call your dad, too. Bitch, call your uncle, too. Bitch, don't call me, too. Always in my ear, your whole fleet. Why my ass be posting guns and only use they feet, too? Hey, like an athlete, I got. Remember who y'all talking to? It's a slaughter gang CEO. I got dick for you if I'm not working, girl. If I'm busy, then fuck no. You need to find you someone else to call when your bank account get low. You need to find you someone. Good morning, Jerry gang. 
morning hey friends if you're new welcome if you're old welcome back to my channel i'm jerry and you're watching life with jerry i'm with the gang i'm with the squad what was you thinking if you're not subscribed make sure y'all subscribe and join the best gang on youtube stop playing with her don't play with her make sure you guys follow me on all my social medias everything is down below turn on those post notifications and yeah like comment share whatever else you want to do you got to do whatever else you feel like doing your heart compels you to do do it yeah but what's up y'all good morning today is March 7th it is currently hold on let me let me turn 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 it's currently 8 46 in the morning I was supposed to bend leave the house y'all but we ain't gonna talk about it we're not gonna talk about it this what happens you have a newborn you never on time to nothing no more to be honest you're just not on time you try your best but you may not be on time and sometimes you may be on time they may cooperate with you some days but today's one of those days where i'm just not gonna be on time all the way i may be on time i may be able to catch up with time now that we're actually in the car but we'll see as you guys can see by that title and that thumbnail today's vlog is 24 hours with a newborn my baby just turned one month yesterday so i have a one month old now so yeah so excited she is growing and glowing and just so pretty and beautiful and yeah so i'm gonna be giving you guys little my little tips and tricks throughout this video and stuff like what i do what i don't do and little stuff like that i don't know we just gonna see how this vlog rock and how this vlog goes y'all are gonna be with me till around this time tomorrow basically so the agenda for today my baby has her one month doctor's appointment today so that's what we're headed to go do right now we're gonna go pick her dad up and then head to the appointment and then after the appointment we're gonna go spend a little bit of time at her dad's so she could spend some time with him and things like that and then we're gonna come home and just see what the day has in store for us how we rock in and things like that because i really don't know honestly we're just kind of going with the flow i don't really have no plans for real y'all just spending 24 hours with me and my baby okay and we just gonna see how it rock and how it flow yeah but yeah that is the plan for this video this morning we got up i tried to set an alarm and get up at seven what kind of pushed me back is i park my car on the street at times and so on first and third uh thursdays is street cleaning i forgot today was the first thursday of the month so therefore it means street cleaning so when my mom left to go to her orientation she called me to let me know like hey they're doing street cleaning you need to come move your car so i had to go get her gate stuff her garage stuff Stuff, um, from her so that way I could park my car in the garage so that way I don't get a ticket because street cleaning tickets are $75 I ain't trying to do all that so that's kind of what pushed me back I had to leave to go do that and move my car and stuff otherwise I would have been a little bit more on time and a little more you know what I mean but I got the baby dressed I fed her and everything I think she might be asleep back there in that car seat to be honest because I don't hear nothing from her so that is great so yeah um she eats six ounce bottles now so she ate majority of that she ate like four almost five ounces so that is good today she gets shot her shots she gets um another set of shots and then at her two-month appointment she gets another set of shots so i'll probably do another one of these at her two-month appointment so you guys can see that or whatever or i'll just do it in a weekly vlog i don't know we'll see but yeah that's the vibes for today's video i hope y'all enjoy i'm a first time mom so if y'all have any tips or tricks let me know down below like whatever y'all see throughout the video or whatever y'all feel like i need just let me know you know i don't mind unsolicited unsolicited advice well this is not really unsolicited because i'm kind of telling y'all y'all good to do it but i got unsolicited advice my whole pregnancy so i'm used to it we good so yeah <laughs> i did not do my hair today or nothing i didn't really have a lot of time for me but it's okay that's why i tried to get up early Early, but it just did not work out all the way but it worked out a little bit at least I was able to do my skincare and stuff and stuff so yeah I feel like I'm talking so freaking fast but I will see you guys probably when we get to the appointment unless AJ drives if he drives then I'll come back on here of course there's traffic when I'm running late y'all I also just realized I didn't eat breakfast I didn't eat nothing yet this morning oh my gosh I pray that I'm able to eat before i like before later i hope my first meal is not at like five six o'clock but we're gonna see i literally have days like this y'all it's no joke like it just be i be baby 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 mother 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 and forget about me 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 but it's okay i'm learning and we're gonna do better we're gonna get better at this at like focusing on us too you know not forgetting about us but it's okay i'm not starving right now but i am gonna need to get food maybe i'll get chick-fil-a after her appointment mm since we'll be out that way 
maybe that's what I'll do. I don't know. I don't know yet. We'll see. <laughs> but I have not ate nothing yet. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I forgot I fumbled that bag. And I've been doing pretty good at making sure I eat breakfast lately. But today is just a lot going on. When I got to leave the house, I be frazzled. That's the problem. I be frazzled. I be feeling like I got a lot going on. I be, I be like all over the place. I be <laughs> like that. So yeah. But <laughs> I'm finna try to hurry up and maneuver through this traffic because I still got to come back all the way this way. Her appointment is all the way this way. I got to go this this way to get him I gotta come back this way to go to her appointment so we're gonna try to race the GPS well not really GPS I know where I'm going but we on a race with time right now we on a race with time we're here uh, we're just waiting on AJ to come outside y'all I, I figured out what I want to do for my birthday my birthday is next month and I wasn't trying to do nothing too crazy too extravagant yet. nothing like where I'm gonna be away from my baby too long because I know I'm gonna miss her and I might want her to come along so because I want to get drunk and have a good time you know my mom said that if she works that day because my birthday is a Sunday so if she works on that day like at night she will call off so that way I can have fun and be able to like get drunk without being worried without worrying about having to come home and take care of the baby which is amazing because I have not really had like been out and had fun in a really long time so i appreciate that so i think what i'm gonna do is i i don't even know if i want to tell y'all because then what if somebody take my idea well it don't really freaking matter because everybody's doing it. it's all over tiktok so i want us to dress up as grannies and go to brunch <laughs> and then we're probably gonna do karaoke later it was either between karaoke a hookah lounge or bar hopping as grannies so i'm leaning more towards karaoke though so we shall see i think that's what i'm gonna do i'm just trying to find a brunch spot for us to go to and then i need to figure out what I want to wear as a granny and I think I want to do birthday photo shoot like a few weeks before and see if my friend can take them for me and edit them for me hopefully fingers crossed so that way I can have cute pictures to post on my birthday aside from being a granny you know what I mean so <laughs> yeah that is what I want to do so we shall see and honestly for brunch I could bring the baby with me to brunch so that's good you know like she could come she could come hang for brunch depending on where we go if it's 21 and up she can't come she can't hang I'm sorry but yeah <laughs> Anyways, we're just waiting on her dad to come out so that way we can head to her appointment. I will see you guys probably at her appointment. Fuck your mind up. Waste time. I'm prone to that. Do it all the time. Keep your guards up. We'll wait in line. You don't need me. Believe me. It's easy. You know I've been feeling. Let me unleash my demons. All done with her appointment baby girl has the hiccups i don't know if y'all can hear her but she got the hiccups right now damn i look dark like can we lighten me up but um we're done with her appointment everything looks good she gained three pounds she grew one inch and she's lifting her head up on her own but she's been doing that honestly she's been holding her own head too for real for real so yeah everything looks good they gave us some more samples for formula but i used the i used the other formula but it's okay i think it should be fine like letting her get that and the other one i don't know it should be fine i don't know they be saying don't switch formula too too much but this only like her second time and she's still gonna be on the other one because the other one is gentle ease and i think it's good for her help with gas and stuff so we're gonna try this one out and see though but yeah about to go to chick-fil-a because your girl is hungry and then um we'll just go from there i don't know <laughs> you farting you had gas but yeah i'm sitting in the back with her right now 
Say hi, Snuggums. She said, girl, I got hiccups. Don't talk to me. It's the baby world. We just living in it. It's Zolani world. I'm just living in it. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all, she didn't hiccup herself to sleep. She's knocked out. So cute. So cute. So cute. Really did that. I... What can I say? If you love me, won't you say something? If you love me, won't you? Love me, won't you? I can do this. I'll fuck up somebody order. What? How? Everything is right there for you. <laughs> what you need, bruh? No pickles? Alright. Forgot to press no pickles, bruh. Fuck. How you forget to press no pickles? A mess. Let me order my food. Damn, it's dark. Oh, well. Hi, uh, Jerry. Yeah. Um, can I get um the spicy Southwest? I mean the spicy chicken sandwich the combo. Meal? Yeah, okay, combo. Um, can I get a sprite? Sprite. And then can I get no pickles on that? Mm -hmm. And then add bacon. Mm -hmm. And then can I get a large fry on the side? Uh, on the side? Yeah, an extra large fry. Are you eating No, that's it. Sauces? Um, no sauce. Okay, so the spicy sandwich meal with the bacon, no pickles, waffle fries, and a Sprite, and a large fry. Yeah. So it's gonna be 20, 22. Mm -hmm. And then you're all set. I'll see you at the window. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Sure you too. I can't wait to get my freaking hair done. This is ridiculous. Ridiculous. Can't wait to be a bad bitch again. I can pick it up then. Hi, Jerry. Yes. You are. Thank you. Did you want any sauce or no sauce? No sauce. No sauce. Thank you. My pleasure. Waiting on that spice. Okay, thank you. My pleasure. Have a great day, guys. Thank you, you too. My pleasure. I love Chick fil A. AJ got in and out. Mrs. I got things also pretty around this time of year. I can't ignore it. I can't I'm just ordering the way with some bonnets and the little ducky that go on the What's up? It's currently, I don't even know what time it is. Hold on, let me see. Let me check my phone. See what time it is. It's five. Hold on. It's 5.45 right now. We are on the way home. We just left AJ's mom's house. As you guys can see, he helped me bring her downstairs, carried her backpack and stuff as usual. Um, so yeah i didn't even eat my chick-fil-a burger but i did get some fries from in and out as well so i ate my in and out fries and i ate my chick-fil-a fries and i didn't eat my burger yet and i drank my whole soda so i gotta eat my burger still but yeah today is a little bit it's not necessarily different because i come to see him like one like two three times a week it just depends on the week so this is just the day where we came to see him and had a doctor's appointment it's a little different because a doctor's appointment is not always but i just wanted to make sure i have a little bit of stuff for y'all to see like film film wise because i didn't want y'all to be bored because i just be in the house for real but when i get home i gotta wash her bottles that we used while we were here and i think i might have one that's still sitting there from this morning i'm not 100 percent sure but i think i 
I do because this morning went by really fast. Like I was running late. It just, everything happened so quickly. So I think I do have one that I need to wash from this morning. I'm gonna see when I get home. So we're gonna wash her bottles and I'm pretty sure she will probably be asleep for the next couple hours. So we're also gonna try to edit, but I also need to catch up on my shows with my mom. So we're gonna see how this goes. But I forgot my AirPods at home, so I didn't get to edit while I was over here. So just to give you guys a small little, a small little rundown of how my days go with baby is we wake up in the morning, and throughout the day i mean we wake up in the morning i feed her or get her ready and stuff i don't give her a bath every day that's why y'all haven't seen me give her a bath because i just gave her a bath yesterday for her three months which i mean when she turned one month what the fuck i'm moving too fast three months is crazy but we gave her a bath yesterday when she turned one month and yesterday was what Wednesday we also give her bath on Sunday so we do every two to three days is when we give her a bath we don't give her a bath every day because newborns don't necessarily it's not recommended to bathe them every single day so we don't bathe her every single day we wipe her down every single day though um so yeah her next bath is probably going to be on Sunday to be honest so that's why y'all didn't see me give her a bath in this video because she just got one yesterday plus we were going outside I didn't want to wash her head and all that stuff and then she you know so yeah so just to answer that in case y'all were wondering about the bath but yeah i wiped her down got her dressed and stuff and then fed her she slept a little bit so usually she sleeps like two three hours a day sometimes she goes to four so yeah and at night i'm not gonna lie she's been getting close to four hours a four hours at night which is beautiful and helps me a lot because all i need be them four hours and i'd be good to go so that'd be helping me out a lot and then throughout the day while she's sleeping i try to do little stuff so main things i try to do is edit and watch my shows i'm working on getting back to me and feeling like myself because i still have yet to feel like myself or get back to me but i think that also has to do a little bit with my ppd so yeah but we working on that we gonna get better and we gonna do better and that's just that on that but other than that like she's good we good so it don't really matter but yeah i i just really be chilling throughout the day i need to do better at doing stuff though like it's only been a month though and i've just been spending the past month like really kind of adjusting to motherhood so i'm trying to get in the habit of getting routines being more productive and things like that there's days where i will sit and i will try to film some sit down videos for my channel last sunday i filmed three videos while she was asleep so you know i'd be trying to do little stuff like that i just try to use the time that she sleep to do whatever i need to do wash her bottles anything i need to do do her laundry also to talk about laundry because y'all aren't going to see me do her laundry in this video i do her laundry right now every sunday unless her laundry gets hella packed or i need a bunch of stuff that are dirty then i'll do it ahead of time but i do it every sunday as of right now and that works really well for me so that's why y'all will not see me do laundry in this video either but i always wash her bottles and then sterilize them immediately after i wash them that's just my bottle washing routine that's just what i do it works for me and i just like doing that um i use the dreft soap and then i use another one which i'll show you guys when i get home also we do have a package to open when we get home because lately well ever since i've had her honestly ever since i found out about her everything's been about her i've been spending nothing but my money on her i don't really spend my money on me no more i don't really shop for myself anymore so she has some packages at home that we need to open up and then i was at, at when i was at aj's mom's house i also ordered her some bonnets because i feel like that would be so cute plus i want to start preserving her hair a little bit better and stuff like that make sure she doesn't have like cradle cap or like anything like that just trying to you know take care of her hair and stuff like that because i don't take care of my hair but i don't want her to be like me at all like i'm gonna do better with her <laughs> so i'm i got her i ordered her some bonnets i think some of them should i did three of them two of them should be coming tomorrow if i'm not mistaken so i'm excited for that i also have an app that i use to track her sleep feeding pooping all of that good stuff i'll show you guys all that when i get home i will tap back in with you guys when i get home so i can focus on driving plus my mom is calling me so i'll see y'all in a second
The baby is actually down sleeping right now. It's currently 6.42 p.m. On a day-to-day -day basis, for the most part, what we do is chill. Like, I am trying to... Let me close my door. Hold on. I'm trying to find more things to do to feel like myself again because, I don't know, I've been stopped getting my lashes, my eyebrows, all that stuff done. I kind of want to get back to getting my nails done, though, and keeping up with my hair for sure because this needs to get done. But I'm getting my hair braided on Saturday, so I feel like that'll make me feel... A little better but i don't feel like insecure or nothing like i'm not dealing with postpartum in that aspect and i'm not feeling like out of body in that aspect but i've been doing stuff like trying to film more edit and stuff like that that kind of makes me feel like me because i just love youtube so much so i've been trying to just be in my craft more and like with being on social media like be trying to get back in my influencer bag that makes me feel like me more you know so i've been trying to do things like that and yeah to make me kind of feel like myself again because i'm not gonna lie child <laughs> after birth you just feel all types of crazy all types of different all types of just i don't know like it's just a whole different type of feeling like you just don't feel like yourself at least for me i just don't feel like myself at all and it could be all the hormones and stuff too i don't know but i'm just doing stuff to work to get better to feel like myself again a good word of advice i know everybody tells you this sleep when the baby sleeps that's true okay but for me it's not that hard like i feel like pregnancy prepared me for nights like these and stuff like that because I got up all the time to pee I couldn't get comfortable like I was losing sleep a lot like especially my last trimester as I got bigger and stuff so I feel like it kind of prepared me for this this really not nothing for me and honestly having a newborn is hard but it's not that hard like the aspect of actually having a newborn is not that hard it's just crazy it's just like having a little human just be so dependent on you and rely on you so much it's just like oh my gosh this is a lot of responsibility but I have a dog not saying a dog is a child but the responsibility is very much pretty much equal or close to at least so I'm kind of used to having somebody like rely on me heavily but babies rely on me way more than dogs okay but I love my child I would not change none of this for the world and I just love being a mother like motherhood was made for me <laughs> i love it so much i wouldn't change it for the world whatsoever if you guys want tips tricks anything like that advice comment below let me know if you have any questions comment them below i could do like a video or whatever i don't know because i don't really know what y'all want to know or what i should talk about for real i know i did talk about the app i use as well to monitor her like eating her sleeping it lets you monitor activities like if you do tummy time with them a whole bunch of stuff like it's a whole lot of stuff on here it's called huckleberry and um it lets you put their name their birthday you can monitor sleep feeding solids when they start doing solids diapers potty when they start pottying pumping if you pump i stopped pumping and i stopped breastfeeding but that's a story for another time i just was not mentally here for that i did i pump i breastfed for like a week and then i went downhill mentally but i'm better now i could try to get back into it but i don't know honestly truly the formula works for us i i don't feel bad about it she's gaining weight as she should she gained three pounds already her head is getting bigger she grew an inch also the doctor said i don't have to wake her up every two to three hours anymore because she's doing so well i could let her sleep a little longer if she needs to or wants to so that's good um and because she is starting to sleep a little longer like at night sometimes i get four hours out four hours out of her so doctor pediatrician says she could start sleeping more throughout and stuff like it don't really i don't really have to wake her up because she's doing great she's feeding well so formula works for us very well and she is not looking any different she is nothing different like she's doing great so maybe i'll just try it with my next kid i don't know it lets you monitor any medicine you're giving them monitor growth temperature any activities like tummy time for example and things like that and it also does give you like recommendations for helping with like nap time and sleep and a whole bunch of stuff like it has a whole lot a whole lot on there it's called huckleberry once again that's the app that i use and i actually really love it, it works really well for us so yeah we're about to go ahead and get into 
my packages. So I got this Baby Delight Snuggle Nest. I hope that she's actually going to use it because we're at the point, y'all, where she won't sleep in her bassinet no more. She sleeps on the bed with me. I don't roll. I don't move. She doesn't roll. She doesn't move, at least not yet. So co-sleeping is not really, like, difficult for me at all. Like, it doesn't alarm me or nothing. We've been doing good, so... I have no issues with co-sleeping as of yet. So, but if any arrives, I will for sure change it up and she will be back in that best net because I'm not about to play. But, yeah. I got this snuggle nest. It's like a, you can move it around and stuff. So, this bassinet, it comes apart, but the bottom doesn't have where it can stay flat on a surface and I can move it downstairs and stuff like that. So, I got this so that when she's sleeping and stuff, I can just put her in this because we've been just putting her on the couch and stuff, which is still no issue, but... Y'all know I'm just that extra mama, okay? I want my baby to have everything. So, yeah. We're about to open this up. I should have brought scissors in here, but we're about to do our best to get this open the best we can without scissors. I didn't think I would need them. I kind of don't, but... Oh, yeah, I don't. And it's very easy to take with you when you need to travel and stuff. So that's really why I bought this one. Because I need something that's easy to move around and stuff. Especially um, if I spend a night somewhere and she comes with me. She can, you know what I mean? So it's this. I don't know if I really want to open it though. <laughs> that's the thing. I am finally, I don't fuck with y'all bitches. Try to, try to take cool. It ain't enough of y'all bitches whatsoever it's not enough never was enough never will be enough yeah okay oh this is very easy to put together it looks like it basically comes together already oh yeah it comes together we love stuff we don't have to assemble stop playing with them please like they are literally not one of them sorry i'm trying to figure this out a little bit look at this oh I think I have to there's something I for sure have to do with it but I just don't know what it is I'm gonna look at the directions but just so y'all can get an idea this is what it looks like it's not gonna fold like this though on her but it's gonna be like flat flat and open like this so we got this for her. Perium. I just gotta figure out how to keep it upright. Oh, to lock it, I slide it this way. Oh, okay. Oh, this is actually easy as shit. See this side to lock it we slide it this way okay there we go so it looks like this and you can move it places with you and everything we love that so she got a new little bed to sleep in or whatever so I'm gonna bring this downstairs with me when I go downstairs and see how she likes it and this is perfect because it comes with a travel bag too. So you can take it with you places. That is amazing. I bought sheets for it. Those bonnets are going to eat down. No gap. I do just be ordering shit, y'all. I'm not going to lie to you. And I might just be in this little phase. Like, you know, because I just had a baby. Like, I want to buy everything. But I don't think this phase is ever going to leave me. I think I'm going to always want to buy everything for my baby. So, Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's a baby care kit. I got one in pink because I just really wanted one in pink. And it comes with a pacifier holder. Okay, I mean a pacifier clip. We love that. I needed another pacifier clip. And this one is cute. It got clouds on it and the moon and it's pink and gray. Really cute. We love that. We needed that. Okay. But I got another care kit. Sorry, my camera is like hella bright and I don't know why. So hopefully it'll 
focus. There we go. I got another care kit and I got it in pink because why not? We love pink and we have a girl, so. This is the dish soap I had got the draft. But honestly, the one that, hold on y'all. Honestly, the dish soap that just finished up, that I just showed y'all me using, I actually really love that dish soap. I think I like that one more than this draft. But see, I didn't know I was gonna like that more than this draft. What happened is, funny story, not really funny, but funny story. I ordered more draft off of Amazon. They said my package delivered, it never came, so I had to report it. And I really needed dish soap, so I ordered that dish soap from Target for same day delivery, and I've been using that one in the meantime while my draft came, and now I love that one more than the draft, and now I have hella draft. But I'm probably gonna still buy that one because buy more of that one because i really like that one draft is not bad though i still like draft but that one just to me cleans the bottle way better than the draft does draft doesn't do bad though but that one eats down like i don't know but now we have hella draft i'm not gonna lie to you but it's okay so yeah hella draft this show but it's okay it's okay and then we have this one too which i'm pretty sure this is the all-purpose cleaner and the laundry stain remover. I'm going to put these in the diaper bag, though, because, yeah. And last but not least. We have more draft. <laughs> I told you I really ordered hella draft because that's all I knew at the time that I ordered it. So now we have hella draft, but we're also going to have hella that one. And we're just going to be good on dish soap, honestly. So that is everything I ordered from Amazon. And yeah, I'm about to go relax. I'm about to grab my AirPods, actually. The AirPods I left here. Where are they? There they go put them in here um i'm about to grab my earpods so when i go downstairs i can start editing i'm also about to eat my chick-fil-a burger i'm about to just chill and take time from recording take a second to stop recording for a little bit and just chill and relax because i feel like i've been on go all day and i'll probably see you guys a little bit later when she wakes back up or something i'm not sure but I'll being on some chill shit we go zero to 100 nigga real quick baby on that rap to pay the bill shit and i don't feel that shit not even a little bit oh lord Know your worth, nigga. My actions being louder than my words, nigga. How you so? I've been still so down to earth, nigga. Niggas won't do it, we can do it on the turf, nigga. Oh Lord, I'm the rookie in the vet. Shout out to the bitches I am. It's currently 9:02. Um, baby just woke up, so I'm about to make her bottle right now, and then um, yeah, I'm just about to make her bottle. I would say we're going to change her, but she's probably going to sleep in her onesie tonight, to be honest, because I'm going to swaddle her anyways, so she'll be pretty warm. I just turned the bottom warmer on as well, and then I'm going to clear up. Since I'm up here, I'm going to clear out the... Y'all hear her? She is... She do not play when she's hungry. She don't play. She gets down, okay? Um, she will scream her lungs out until she gets food. She don't play. But while this is warming up for her, I'm going to clear out the um, the sterilizer as well so I can put new bottles in throughout the night because I'm about to feed her throughout the night. So I want to make sure I have that cleared out for her. Well, for myself. Makes my life easier. So we're going to clear out the sterilizer. Um, I have one bottle to put in there right now and then I'm going to have this one that I'm about to feed her with. Um, and then whatever else I make throughout the night. I was going to put her in PJs, but honestly, I think I'm going to keep her in a onesie and swaddle her. Because the swaddle is really warm and it's thick, so I don't really think I need to do the most, truly and honestly. Plus, it's easier to change her throughout the night with the onesie. <laughs> Always got to make your life easier. But let's go ahead and clear out this sterilizer and get it ready and prep to put more stuff in. So these two are going to go in her diaper bag 
because they came from her diaper bag. So these are going to go back in her diaper bag. So I'm going to take them back downstairs. I also am going to bring up my coldest water water bottle that I use to put her water in. I, um, I warm water up in the kettle to put in her bottles to put her formula in. So I have some warm water in there. So I'm going to try to see if they'll fill up these four bottles. And then I'm going to put, I'm going to go put more water on the kettle to boil. <laughs> I don't know why I'm having a great my mom is feeding the baby right now i got a package from tiktok shop but i'm not gonna open that right now and i have to pee hold on yeah like i said i got a package from tiktok shop but i'm not gonna open that right now but yeah as you guys can see i kind of get my bottles a little bit prepped throughout the day for the night or for the day for the morning whatever the case may be when i run out i try to be on top of getting them prepped washing sterilizing taking them out the sterilizer i boil water to put in her bottles to put with the formula so yeah in case you guys are wondering i boil water on the kettle um so yeah i'm about to i prepped her bottles for tonight so we should be good to go for throughout the night she has about five bottles ready to go she should be good for the night honestly and probably through a little bit of the morning and then those bottles will end up in the sterilizer throughout the night and i'll sterilize them again in the morning and wash them as i go that's how i do y'all will see because i'm a record throughout the night for you guys because we're still part of we're still on the 24 hours so y'all will see a little bit of how feedings go throughout the night for me but that's what i do because i gotta work smarter not harder so i prep as best as best as i can i do want to um, move forward with like prepping even better and like actually making the formula and putting it in the refrigerator because it lasts for 24 hours so i think i'm gonna start doing that is like prepping the formula and putting it in the refrigerator so that way when she does wake up and i change her all i gotta do is pop it in the warmer and let that be that but yeah that is what i do and yeah i think that's what i'm gonna start doing soon but anyways yeah so that's how i get her bottles ready and stuff like that i do keep it in the coldest water bottle too as well the one i'm about to boil right now is going to stay in the coldest water bottle and it stays warm really hot actually for about 24 hours so the water gonna get used anyways tomorrow so we good there i may put pajamas on her i may just keep her in her long sleeve onesie because the swaddle is pretty thick so she should be good throughout the night um i will show you guys the swaddle in a second i actually think i have to do number two so i'm gonna try to hurry up and do that before the kettle is done because my mom is busy feeding the baby so you know gotta help as best as i can she's helping me out so i gotta help yeah but i will see you guys in a second this is the swaddle i'm talking about it is pretty freaking thick Y'all can't even see what's going on with it, but let me show y'all. Y'all saw me take it off for this morning, but it's pretty thick. So it's like this. It zips up. It puts her arms through it, and then you swaddle her. So it's pretty thick. This is why I don't feel like I need to put too many layers on her because then she would just overheat. So I'm about to bring this downstairs, and I'm about to put pajamas on real quick. And probably next time I see you guys will probably be either before we go to bed or at her next feed after we wake up because honestly after she's done eating there i'm about to put her to sleep and we're gonna come upstairs and i'm gonna try to go to sleep so it's about night time for me <laughs> and then we'll see what time she feeds again um after this feed so i'll probably just see you guys when i wake up 
in the middle of the night throughout the night and stuff also real quick this is my bed setup because i'm very lazy at night i already have to get up to make her bottle but i don't be wanting to get up to change her because i always change her before i feed her so i have her wipes here i have the aquaphor that i rub on her booty and i have some diapers here and then i just have some water for me in case i get sleep in case i get thirsty throughout the night so this stays on my bed it makes my life so much easier <laughs> i don't even use her changing station at the moment but yeah, this is my little bed uh, station because <laughs> I just changed her right here on my bed. So we got the boiled water in here. I'm just going to put this here. So these are all her bottles that she does not use anymore because she does not eat this small anymore. She's a big girl now, but I just let this sit, this bottle, big bottle sit here. This has her, her kettle. <laughs> Heated water and I'm more than likely gonna go ahead and wash the bottle that she's eating out of right now so that way I don't have to worry about it tonight with the bottles I'm about to add on and then I'm about to get her some pajamas for her I'm just gonna go ahead and put her in pajamas and then swaddle her I think this is really cute this is really cute it's a little pajama dress a sleep dress so I think I'm gonna go ahead and put her in this little sleep dress so yeah time to get my baby ready for bed and then when we come back from when we come up from downstairs i always make sure the room is dark so when i bring her up the light doesn't wake her up i just be having whatever youtube videos playing sometimes it's ones i'm watching sometimes it's random i didn't put this one on it just kind of been playing but yeah and she's probably gonna sleep in the bed with me tonight so yeah but i just get the room prepped for her and i keep it dark in here for her because if i come in with the light on she is going to wake up she had a lot any extra bottles besides the one we actually the ones we actually used throughout the night and now for real for real we're gonna burp her get her ready for bed and bring her up here so we can go to bed. <laughs> Instead of putting her on the actual like bed with me and actually co-sleeping, I'm going to try out this because I bought it. So I might as well use it to the best of capability. So I'm going to see if she'll sleep in this. If she does, then that will be my new co-sleeping thing because she has not been fucking with this. That's why I stuff all in here because she don't fuck with it. She want to sleep with me. So fuck it, you know. So we're going to try this out. This is my sleeping setup for tonight. something she only been asleep for like an hour but she's been like waking up a little fussy so i'm trying to like put her back to sleep with her pacifier because i'm tired I... please go back to sleep please fingers crossed that she will put herself back to sleep with that pacifier <sighs> I'm just trying to put her back to sleep. I really want to sleep a little bit. But she's just a little fussy tonight. Let's see, she has a pacifier in her mouth. And she's crying like that. It's okay. What the matter, Tinka? Okay, it's one in the morning. Um, I'm about to go ahead and change her and make her a bottle. 
and put her back down. I'm so tired. I'm gonna see y'all. I'm gonna see y'all when I see y'all. Y'all don't see me change her and feed her a million times. I don't think y'all need to see her that again. So I'm just updating y'all on times right now. I'm gonna see y'all when I see y'all. All right, y'all. So it's currently 2:14 in the morning. Um, she got done eating at like 1:50 something. She's been asleep for like 20 minutes now. Let's see. I'm out of breath, y'all. Sorry the stairs. But as you guys can see, she's been asleep for like 20 minutes now. So, yeah, I just brought her upstairs because we were downstairs. Uh, my mom changed her and fed her for me. I made her bottle. Um, so, yeah, I'm about to try to go back to sleep now. And I will see you guys the next time she wakes up. Hopefully, hopefully, the next time she wakes up, it's time for me to end this vlog. And it would have been 24 hours. But we gonna see. But, um. Oh, sorry, I'm on a phone with AJ, but he's asleep. So, um, yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit. I might just try to give me some sleep now, for real, because I'm tired. But it's like, I kind of feel like I'm not tired anymore because now I was just up and my mom was talking and chopping it up and stuff. Now I'm not sleepy, but I'm about to try to go to sleep because I'm sleepy. I mean, I'm tired. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Clearly, I need to go to sleep. <laughs> I'll see y'all in a little bit. Good morning guys, it's 5.13. She's waking up right now. Um, So I'm about to go ahead and get her um, changed and stuff and get her bottle together and feed her. But she's kind of falling back asleep, but I know it's time for, she's probably ready to eat. Look at her. Hi cutie, patootie. But um, she was just crying, I swear. <laughs> I'm so tired. It's 5.14 in the morning right now. Yeah, it's 5.14. She's been asleep for three hours and 21 minutes. So it's about that time, so. Oh my God. Oh, fuck, I'm tired. I'm so tired, y'all. I was sleeping so good. Then I heard, ah, ah, I said, oh, fuck. But I'm going to see y'all in a second. I'm so tired, Jesus. Maybe I'm going to see if my mom want to help me again with this. <laughs> oh, yeah. um, my mom is, oh my God. Oh, oh, fuck. My mom is changing her. Let me stop her sleep and mark her diaper as well. Y'all hear her screaming? When she's hungry, she don't play. She gets down. She gets down, she don't play. But my mom is changing her diaper right now. Her bottle is warming up. This is the bottle I put her vitamin D drop in. Hopefully, she finishes this bottle. I usually put it in her morning one. So, it was either going to be this one or the next one. I'm hoping she finishes this one all the way so that we're good. Because I put it in this one. But I got a package from Amazon. I'm pretty sure this is a swaddle I just ordered for her. So we're going to open up this package. Yep. It's because the swaddle says that they get a lot more sleep, y'all. I'm honestly a sucker for like ads and shit. But I got it in a size small. It's a stage one swaddling. It's um, for 8 to 13 pounds in size one. Cause she's nine pounds now so she my baby a little bigger now yeah <laughs> but it's the love to dream swaddle up swaddling in a natural arms position it's the original one and i got it in pink um so yeah oh wow so they have this one which is swaddling they have this stage two which is transitional and they have stage three which is for independent sleep okay but this is what it looks like i got it from amazon i ordered it literally last night <laughs> and it's here already so we love that for me i'm gonna try this out on her tonight y'all unfortunately probably will not see it but it's okay y'all will see it in another video if i like it and stuff i'll update you guys but this is what i got and then i got her some more bows as well um so yeah because i never i thought i wasn't gonna be a mama that 
put my baby in a lot of bows. I'm just gonna be completely honest with y'all. I was like, I don't like bows. Like, my baby's not wearing hella bows, but they're just so cute on her. So I ordered more because everybody else bought all the bows that I have right now. I never bought any bows for her. I literally said if, if nobody buys bows, she's not getting in bows. But I'm glad people did so I could see how they look on her and see how I like them. Because I said a lot of stuff. I also said I wasn't going to be like a huge pacifier mama. But baby, she be getting that pacifier, okay? I do not. I don't play. I get down. <laughs> when, it come to, when it comes to that pacifier, I get down. I don't play. So, yeah. But we got some more bows for my baby. So she could be so cute. Like literally it's so many bows. So it's a whole pack of bows. And then her bonnet comes today too. So I can't wait for that one. She's going to be rocking that at night as well. But yeah. Um. Fuck, I'm so I'm tired, y'all. I really am. But I'm about to bring my AirPods downstairs with me, and I'm about to edit. Um, to be honest, so I'm gonna bring my AirPods down with me and edit. I'm pretty sure my mom will help me out and feed her, cause my mom's changing her for me. So I'm gonna just see if I can edit a little bit while she eats and stuff and gets ready for um bed again, and then I'm gonna probably come back up here and try to sleep one more time i don't know or i'll just sleep downstairs i don't know we'll see but i will come back on here later for you guys whenever she either wakes back up or it's time to end this video i don't know i forgot what time i started it yesterday so we'll just see next time i come on here it's gonna be for updates and to end it probably i don't freaking know but i will see you guys in a little bit I'm going to try to edit. I might go to sleep if my mom helps me out with her, to be honest. But we're going to see. Hey, guys. Good morning. Oh, my God. I'm so tired. I was just sleeping so good. Mouth wide open and all. I was just sleeping so freaking good. It's currently... She don't know if she want to wake up or go back to sleep. It's 7.31. She's been asleep for an hour and 25 minutes. And I'm trying to figure out what she's doing. Like, is she staying up or is she going to sleep? I don't know because it looks like she's going back to sleep. But we're going to unswaddle her and probably take her downstairs real quick. I want to show you her dress. So let's get her out this swaddle and get her feeling comfortable. Because I know she probably feels so. She's going to feel so much relief. <laughs> let's get you out of this swaddle, baby. Oh, farting on me is crazy. Look how cute her dress is. dress is she's also so cute but yeah i'm trying to see what she's trying to do catch her vibe is she trying to wake up go back to sleep i don't know she just keeps farting on me though and smiling hi hi good morning snicker good morning tinkapoo but um if she wakes up we're gonna change her and feed her um but i will come back on here in a little bit to give you guys like some closing outs close out this video talk about whatever i feel like talking about i don't know but i will see y'all in a second i'm so freaking tired i'm about to go see what the vibes are downstairs real quick <laughs> because if i could try to get a little more sleep i'm going to try to do that i'm so tired we're about to see i'll be back on here in a little bit don't let it go let it go it's 9 38 in the morning right now she fell asleep maybe like five minutes ago i'm not sure 
um i kind of started timing her late so right now i'll say like three minutes but i think she fell asleep like maybe close to 10 minutes ago not even five but it's okay i was on tiktok shop so i wasn't really paying too much attention i was just letting her sleep i didn't really pay attention to the time and stuff but yeah um that is basically it for this video that's my 24 hours with the newborn i went a little over 24 hours with for you guys but that's okay because it all is on the feeding and stuff um i did want to say she feeds about yesterday she ate about five times throughout the day the day before that she ate about seven i want to say or more i'm not sure but it just all depends if you guys want a video on how much my newborn eats let me know because i'm thinking about doing that and that would be just solely like feeding and with time stamps and everything like that not every day is the same though i will say that some days she's a little more hungry some days she's chilling more some days it's because she'll eat six ounces every feed so she doesn't really need to eat as much like she'll eat every four hours or so and then some days when she eats like four ounces or two ounces she'll eat every two to three hours it just all depends on how much she really eats when getting fed so that's another factor like the past couple feeds she ate almost all six ounces this feed right now she ate like three ounces so you know it just all depends but yeah and then it also depends how long she sleeps sometimes she sleeps two to three hours sometimes she sleeps four to five and now the pediatrician said we could just let her sleep if she sleeps longer it's okay because she's getting everything she needs it's full food wise and stuff so that's good um i give her the vitamin d drops every day in her food so that's that's what i do you know it's recommended to give them vitamin d drops so i do that i mean it was recommended to me at least i don't know i'm just a first time mom but yeah i don't know what else to say um we're probably gonna do a little tummy time today and stuff as well later in the day but right now she's just in her bouncer she sleep she's sleeping hella good too i'm gonna put a blanket over her but um anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this 24 hours with the newborn video don't forget to like comment subscribe if you guys want another 24 hours when she hits two months let me know because her habits and our routines and stuff may change and i may get routines and stuff and that will be when she can actually be outside and stuff so we might be able to get a little more oomph in the video i did this one specifically yesterday just so y'all could get a little more content out of me like her doctor appointment and stuff like that and seeing her dad and stuff like that instead of just us just in the house but i did also talk about what i do when it's just us in the house so you guys get an idea so i hope it was very informative i hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to like comment subscribe if you're not already subscribed what are you doing hit that subscribe button because i'm coming with the heat and the authenticity and the transparency and the aesthetics but i hope you guys enjoyed the video nonetheless don't forget to like comment subscribe and turn on your post notifications don't mind my dog um and i will catch you guys in my next video let me leave you on a quick positive note eat your face not people bye usually i don't do this often but since recruiting isn't an option due to one you